Hope you are. It's a production ready open source dashboard UI kit and design system to build better web app lightning fast. And it has a lot to offer for the designers and developers like you. And there are a number of quality elements, components, pages and design system for you to work with. After launch of Hope UI last year, we were thrilled to see how it was helpful for the users and how it empowered our community of development. And with this amount of feedback, we are back with Hope UI Pro for this year and it is professionally made for the professional who are looking for the richest web app for their work. Hope UI Pro is thoughtfully designed to create user-centric project without starting from the scratch and it will speed up your workflow and your efficiency. So I am Asit Seek from Iconic Design and in this video, we will see some insights of Hope UI Pro. So let's see what are the requirements of Hope UI you need. And the first one is the 14 version of Node. And the second is you need at least 6.14.12 version of NPM. And talking about software, you can use the VS code or you can choose whatever you are comfortable with. And talking about the browser, you can use any like Google Chrome or you can use Safari as well. Now let's talk about the skills. What kind of skills you required for Hope UI? So for the, first of all, for the HTML dashboard, uh, you will need the basic knowledge of HTML, CSS and JavaScript and if you are new to this, you can just go and check out some uh, development courses and you can use the YouTube channel also. Now for the main dashboard of Hope UI that is HTML or Gulp version, you need the knowledge of Handlebar and we will be coming with a video soon. For CSS version, you can refer to the doc file that I will be providing in description. And for the JavaScript, you can also see some of the YouTube videos that will help you for now. And for the Gulp, you can see the documentation that will be provided officially. That's all for the skill requirement right now. Now let's start with the setup and installation. So we will extract the zip and we will be having these two folders for Hope UI that is HTML and the one is Gulp handlebar. Our Gulp plus HBS plus HCSS is our source code for where all the code is generated and our HTML has also generated from here. So initially we will run the HTML version as you guys prefer HTML more than Gulp. So let's open uh, HTML version in VS code. Here in VS code our project is started using editor and we can make any changes easily like changing a code and all and to run this project simply click on html file first in folder and if you do it directly the system will ask you which file you want to open and we don't need that right so we also want the pages to be auto updated so to do that there is one extension in vs code live server it will auto update the pages as soon as we save the file and it will open the file with the live server now if you guys want to change anything, I will simply go to the file and make the changes like changing the title or the sidebar. I want to change the name of the dashboard in the sidebar. So I will just replace admin here and I will save the code and the name is changed on the web as well. You can see it. Similarly, if you want to change the name of a project name, from here you can do it too and you can see this app name here. And if you change the value from here, you can see this change. And apart from that, we have an option for customizing the basic of our web by using our customizer. Going into this customizer and we can see the multiple settings like sidebar, color, etc. That can directly change including the project name. So I am changing my project name to just this dream project. And you can see this change very easily. Hope UI comes with the feature of live customizer. That is, if you want to make any changes that you have done default, you can use the live customizer. Click on copy and pick and then paste this setting in this option. Now, if you open the link in new tab, you can see the customized dashboard as our default. Just imagine how helpful and work friendly this feature is. And we will see in depth live customizer in our upcoming videos in this series. So this is where we end our HTML version. So now let's start with the Gulf version. And to set up the Gulf version, we will open the project in VS Code. And now following step will be to run the command npm install in your terminal. And using this command, all the dependencies related to your development server will be installed and secondly all the plugin dependency related to the project will also get installed and once all the dependencies installed enter the command npm run watch in your terminal 
and so you will be wondering where this watch is getting data from so let me explain you for that simply go to packet.json this file contains the script so here we can see by using watch it will run gulp watch so if you directly run this line of command then also our project will run don't worry about it here in dev if you don't want this mini files let's change the element to the false and here if you want the mini files asset then run the command gulp build or npm build in your terminal here you can see our project has run and this is happening and here you can see our project panel and if you click on live demo you can see our project and in the same way just like html you can do any kind of customizing and anything that you want in this project too and that's all for getting started with Hope UI. And there are many videos in this series which will guide you for Hope UI Pro. So it will help you in your work efficiency and all of that stuff. And this series is all about Hope UI Pro. But if you're also interested in a free version, you can just check out our Hope UI and you can use it for your projects. And make sure to like, subscribe, and hit this bell icon. And you can share this video to the developer so they can also take advantage of this marvelous project. Till then, hasta luego.